start recording, shall we? And we'll go from there. Uh, where's the song? How Much a Dollar Cost by Kendrick Lamar. James Fauntleroy and Ronald Eiley on the album To Pimp a Butterfly with explicit content. That's, that's yeah, lovely. How much am I going to use it? Alright, so like, I mean, I can't complain. That's definitely fantastic. I'm not going to go into the lyrics because they're just too good and like that actually, actually requires effort. What I will say though is I love the, um, what do you call it? I love the dynamic of it. The, it, it flows really nicely and that is so bland, so I, whatever. Uh, it flows nice. It's fantastic. It's good. It's great. It's, it's lovely. It's, it's, uh, the minor chords are really nice. They're they're really offsetting, really. That they're, they're not like a typical hip hop song where it's just it's just them bloating, bloating. Is that is that right? Where let's have a look here. <laughs> yeah, sure. Uh, it's them make or becoming swollen with fluid or gas. Yes, we'll go with that one. Uh, gloating. That's the one I'm looking for. Uh, it's it's not it's not a rapper gloating. It's it's a freaking amazing story, and I know what you mean now. Like. Woo boy! I love I love this guy. Thank you, Carlo, and thank you, William, for this suggestion. I am sure as heck, and I didn't know he actually made a humble either. Anyway, that's off topic to my music review. Music review, fantastic song. Ten out of ten would recommend. This is going to be so cringy when I come back to reanalyze this video. Reanalyze, rewatch this video. Ah, oh, holy words. Um, love it. Good, good stuff. Kendrick Lamar, good man. Good dynamics. It, it, it drops in places. It drops in places where it doesn't, doesn't need to drop. But that's what keeps your attention. Like the bass drops and and the drums drop for a little bit for like a, a one bar or whatever, and then they come straight back in. It's just, it's just nice. It keeps your attention. It makes you focus on the words. It's, it's absolutely wonderful. The fact that it's a little swanky. That's that that just really really makes it like for, for a rap song to be swanky. That's cool That's just that's just cool like you, you, there's, there's no really other well There's probably 20 billion other ways to describe it, but it's really cool and Nice and really adds emphasis to the story where this is a casual laid-back whatever like conversation between him and a hobo um The minor chords really make it so he's the antagonist. He's he's not saying it because he's the good guy. He's saying it because he's the bad guy and he didn't want to make a change in this hobo's life. At least that's what I've gotten in the brief listening of these lyrics that I've had. And it's it's really set the mood. It's not said that the hobo's the antagonist because it's saying that he's doing something wrong. Because it starts off with him and it ends with him and they're both on sad notes. That it's not saying that he's in a sad part of his life. It's saying that he did something wrong. I love it. Fantastic. Anyway, crappy little music review. Hope you enjoy. I'm not going to include this part of the video because it's just it's just so stereotypical. Uh, lovely. I hope my camera's even. Hope I'm actually on center screen. <laughs> I'm not on center. Yeah, there you go. I'm on center screen now, and this is probably going to be a jump cut to me now all of a sudden being on center screen. Maybe, maybe I should have it off screen and I can have it in a, you know, yeah, I'll, I'll do that. I'll do that. There we go. And then it can be there. Anyway, lovely. Nice jigsaw. It's up there, isn't it? So, yeah, okay, cool. Ah, uh, lovely. Mm-hmm. 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 All right. Uh, it's probably a terrible music review. And, yes, I missed it.